Hello everyone, it's Sunday the 29th of May today, so we're going to bring in the Mary Queen of Angels deck to bring in a message from Mother Mary. So what does Mother Mary want to say to us all today? Wow, thank you angels. So look at this, straight out patience. So remember that patience is power. It says I trust in divine timing. So your journey, your life, your mission Everything you've been through in the past and everything you will go through in the future is all in divine timing. And as a spiritual being having this human experience, we must learn to trust in the process of our life. And then we don't feel trapped. We don't feel contained. We don't feel like something's wrong or missing in our life because we understand everything is exactly how it's meant to be. And there's always a plan. So if we feel like we're going round and round in circles, when we start to trust in divine timing, we free ourselves and we feel free. And it's liberating because patience is power. And it's also understanding what patience is. Patience is about being kind, being loving, being unconditional about things in your life, about just being at peace and being in the flow of things, not forcing things to happen not waiting around, clock watching, or wishing something was different, just being in the now. And that's the true meaning of patience. And when we embrace that, we free ourselves and we move into life every day, seeing it as a beautiful adventure. And that's what the goat is symbolizing. So step out of your comfort zone today and feel free. And what this is reminding me of is Mary Poppins, because in Mary Poppins, in the original one, you know, they're on the carousel and then Mary kind of creates the magic where the horses jump off the carousel and so they go on a great adventure. So instead of going round and round and round, they go somewhere else. So when we take control of our lives by saying, I am now trusting in this journey, I don't need to control anything because it's all under control. I know who I am and where I'm going and what I want and I allow the universe to bring everything to me at the right time, then you allow yourself to go on a great adventure. So every day you wake up feeling grateful and excited about your day. And you say, isn't that interesting? So when something happens that may trigger you or upset you, instead of feeling like a victim or being in pain, you actually acknowledge the way you feel and you say, okay, isn't this interesting? Why is this happening to me? Why do I feel this way? What is this teaching me? How is this an opportunity to grow my soul? And the signs will also help you because, you know, if you're waiting for something to happen and you don't know when it's going to happen and it's causing anxiety, you receive the signs that show you not only it's real, but also that it's on its way. And when you're being patient and you're trusting in divine timing, you get bombarded with signs that buoy your faith and also keep you strong. It says, I watch for, notice and trust the signs that heaven continually sends. And all you have to do is ask and it's given. So if you ask for a sign, it's given to you. But you have to be open and aware to receive that sign. Instead of looking at your phone, Sometimes you do see messages and signs on your phone though. But when we're overwhelmed or we are busy in our mind or we're overthinking, we can miss out on those signs. So the angels are asking you to relax, to trust, and the signs will come. And also look at this, to have faith, to have faith in your journey. It says, I have faith in God to heal this situation. With God, all things are possible. Whether you believe in God, the higher power, the universe, Father Sky, Mother Earth, whoever you're connecting with, that's the universal power that heals this situation. And with the creator, the creator of all things, all things are possible. So the message today is have patience. The signs are reminding you to have faith. The signs you are seeing are giving you faith. And keeping your faith strong because when you have a small amount of faith, you can move mountains. And then you free yourself, you feel strong and you think, why was I ever worried about that? Why was I ever concerned about that? And, you know, think about everything that's happened in your life to this point now. Everything that happened in the past, even if you didn't understand it, has got you where you are. And I'm sure you can look back now and 
really respect and realize why things had to happen that way. So give it to heaven today. So I feel you're going to see many signs today that give you faith. You may see a goat that symbolizes adventure and that reminds you to move ahead. You may even see carousels or horses because horses symbolize freedom. And to remind you there's a lot of movement coming in as we move forward. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.